feel like looking at an empty checkerboard. And in this room right now, I have the room lights off, but the room is fairly white. I create white surfaces and things around the room, have a screen behind me. So the ANSI contrast here is very low. But because of the way the camera works and because of the way our eyes work, these dark rectangles will still look fairly dark, even with a low ANSI contrast. But I'll show you what they look like without the white part biasing your eye or the camera. So here I will block part of the image, and you'll get to see what that black level actually looks like. Now this black here is actually even a little darker than it was when I was just showing it to you because I've reduced the reflections, but yet it looks very bright. If that were your black level for watching movies, it'd be pretty disappointing with a lot of stuff. But fortunately, that isn't the black level for watching movies necessarily. Now I'll go to the black level from this projector instead of the black level from this ANSI contrast pattern. So now if I back up to the pattern for the black level from the projector, I can see a little bit of light coming through that hole, but the camera is probably not even picking that up. I'll take it away. Probably, I don't know if the camera is even picking that up, but it's significantly different. So the, ANSI, the black level during that ANSI checkerboard and the black level on the darkest scenes here are two very different things.